Hi, my name is Suchishmita Saha and I am 28 years old and I am from Tripura. I am the founder of Eureka Iconic Group and Eureka Home Solutions. We are mainly into the construction business and uh, we, are, we also have our own retail chain where we sell everything related to construction and we are operating in Tripura since 2018 end and so far the journey has been really good. So we started uh, decorating uh, like uh, the interior design what we do. In that entire process, our customers are very much involved. So when we design a house, a building or a space, it reflects the customer's taste and it is as per their budget. So I think we are very budget friendly and we don't repeat our designs. Unique thing about our brand, uh, like when we started, we started with Eureka Home Solutions. So it is basically an interior designing firm. What we realized is that, uh, especially in Tripura, people re they really want to build their, you know, uh, they want a unique thing about their house and their interior. But the thing is, we are so disconnected from the mainland that certain products are not available here. Plus the quality of workers and designers, I mean we really lack that in our state especially. So that's how we started with Eureka Home Solution. We started giving our customers products which are very unique. I had uh, left my uh, placement and uh, I was 24 years old when I started. So when I came to my hometown for uh, to start business, I realized that too many girls over here, they are not into mainstream business and the kind of business I got into and what I have, I am doing right now, you don't find a lot of women in this. So uh, I basically to start any business, you need a uh, fund. So since I didn't have that kind of funding and I didn't look for investors. So what I started doing is interior designing where the business used to run on advance payment by the clients. And I think what we really did was we focused on our products and customer service. So there are two segments when you look into interior designing. There's normal designing, which everyone does. And now this is this new trend which is coming up, which is luxury space designing, where you create really beautiful stuff, which is monolithic. There are different, different themes which are going around, I mean, very global stuff. And so we try to create that kind of work, but then we try to make sure that it is within your budget. So when we design a home, it truly reflects something very unique and we try to give a feel, a warmth, which is very personal. Uh, it is extremely difficult to first of all start a business because for business you need money and to make a brand stand out and to earn that credibility in the market i think it's really really challenging i think at times it takes a lifetime at times i think it takes few years but then it is it is something definitely you know it comes from your customer so what we you know always focus on is customer service so what we always tell our customer and what we have been telling them for the past three years is that you know whenever you face a problem just give us a call so we try to attend to every need of the customer and we try to do it in the shortest span of time we have done two projects in Kolkata so far and they are really beautiful and people have been appreciating our work over there as well so what we are trying to do is uh, open our retail chain in Kolkata by the end of next year and hopefully in many other cities. I think when I started as a uh, uh, undergrad, a fresher, I was uh, not that confident about myself and I was not, uh, uh, how do I say, I used to, I think I used to judge myself a lot and I used to overthink a lot about a lot of things. It was also because of my gender probably because this is a very male dominated industry. 
so if i can change anything about myself i think uh, i would uh, definitely uh, like to uh, if i can change one thing about myself then i would definitely if i i wish i could be bolder and i could be more confident at that the time i mean it would have saved a lot of time uh, and i think i would have been a little uh, quick and little bold in my decision making process as well i mean it would have really helped me but i'm learning now <laughs>